Hello, I'm Jerry Ford, the beer review guy. Couldn't hold them like together and push the button at the same time. So I'm gonna review a uh, a chili seasoning from Class Company, K L A S S Chilito seasoning um, with chili pepper powder and real lime. No artificial flavors or colors. Made in Mexico. Um, it's it's really really hot here today. It's like I just looked at my forecast temperature and it's eight, it says 89. Feels like 102, and that's just like because of the humidity. It is really really humid out right now. Um, so this sounded really go good. I got a Famosa Lager beer. I'm gonna try with this seasoning. Um, ingredients: You got salt, chili pepper powder, citric acid, dehydrated lime juice. Um, that's really about it. It says for lot for lot and best before date. See cap. Keep in a cool and dry place. This is not a candy. Those of you that think it's a candy, it's not a candy. This is a seasoning. Okay, I mean, it doesn't say that it's for beers, but I'm gonna use it for a beer. Kind of orange, orangish. Almost got like a, like a seasoning salt kind of appearance to it. Mm. Oh wow! This is this is like a candy. Pretty salty. Ooh, bam! Really strong lime. Getting that chili powder in there. There's a little bit of sugar in there. Kind of sweet and salty. That's pretty good. All right. Well, let's see what it's like on a. Let's see what it's like on a beer. I'm just gonna shake some off here. Not that much. That should be enough to put on this beer here. Got some limes I've been needing to use up here. I'm just gonna just gonna do this. I'm just gonna do this right here. Okay. And I'm gonna do this right here. Oh yeah. That's plenty enough for up there. really good I'm very thirsty Famosa is kind of a light kind of a light lager light in appearance um, you know it, I mean, it's flavorful it's but it almost reminds me of like a light beer I got a wasp like flying around my feet down here all right, let's see what it's like in a beer. Oh, wow. Oh yeah, it tastes good in a beer. Chilito. Just got an overcast it's funny how just like clouds blocking the Sun for just a minute can give you so much of a of a, of a um, <coughs> what's the word Crap, I can't 
can't think of it. <coughs> Not a refreshing feeling, because that's what this is doing. Ah, that's pretty good. Might as well use this lime. Don't want to waste it. Okay. This wasn't very much. I can't remember how much it was, but it was pretty cheap. Um, Okay, class. This company makes like um, packages of, of like horchata. Um, there's something else they make. Um, shoot, other kind of mixes that you mix with like water. Um, they make this. Uh, but you can buy buy. Excuse me. Excuse me again. You can get this in, um, I think, Walmart's, I think, class products. Um, but uh, there you go. It's showing a chili pepper and a lime on here. Um, and just, there's not really any spiciness to it. It's not really spicy. Um, No, just a mild chili pepper, chili powder. Um, the salt is kind of a, a little, a little larger granule, granules in there. Um, instead of fine, fine, you know, finely grounded. But uh, <clears throat> yeah, very good. This would be good on a on the rim of a michelada, which I need to do some micheladas. Haven't done any in a while. Okay, I'm gonna end it there. I thank you all for watching. I appreciate it. Let me know if you've happened to have tried this before. What you thought of it? That's pretty good. I've had. I mean, I've had some a better. Um, <clears throat> you know, tahini is a little better than this. Um, the little larger granules of salt are a little bit harder to get used to because I'm, I'm not crunching them, you know. But, uh, but it's, it's all right. This would be good on like, you know, fruits or vegetables type thing. Um, so there you go. All right, I'm going to end it there. I thank you all for watching. I appreciate it. See you on the next one.